come on i mean come on where is the innovation creativity where is the imagination why are we continuing to do this to ourselves kabza directed by r chandru starring very very talented and creative mr upendra sir also in smaller roles akicha sudeep and a cameo by shivanna now this movie and shriya sardan of course and many other people too many other people actually so the biggest problem with kabza is that it is absolutely outdated this is not something we have not seen and today that is the biggest factor when bahubali came out and kgf came out and many movies that have done well even the smaller ones they are doing well because they are unique they are innovative they are creative they are presenting something never seen before on a scale never seen before a story never told before so many movies that i've reviewed on my channel you can see that there are many creative elements to it if i give them a good rating kabza has nothing new to offer and is basically a template of kgf that has been completely tried to convert but you can see the parallels and all of that and therefore it does not work and i said this in my trailer and teaser reaction to kabza if you have not watched that if it resembles kgf more than 10 minutes of the film 15 minutes of the film this film is not going to work and that is exactly what happened the resemblance to kgf someone whose mother is you know some a kid who grows up his mother you know something happens to the family his mother is the only one taking care of him and therefore he gets into the underworld and what happens next and how he navigates that life of the underworld and becomes the biggest gangster ever such an outdated story now a story can be outdated as i always say but a screenplay and presentation has to be new and that is also where kabza lacks screenplay is absolutely a disaster i like what was happening in the film you don't understand that a screenplay has to go hand in glove with the cinematography the editing cuts as well as the music and it has to be unique and creative if you rehash ideas such as black screens coming and going loud bgm and not required extra slow motion sequences dialogues that seem to be copied by you know seem to have been delivered in the same way that yash or anybody else has delivered everything will remind you of something and it's not going to work this is why we have never made another bahubali no matter who tries it how you try it we have never been able to deliver another historic epic in that sense after bahubali similarly we will never be able to deliver another kgf style movie if we keep doing the same things villains that are out and out completely crazy you know so many sub villains from the main villain so many such an organizational structure almost this one wants kabza of this that one wants kabza of that that one wants to take over this that one wants to reign everybody wants everyone every the one wants everything oh my god come on where are the motivations where is the background who are these people why are they there why are just you know they existing on the face of the earth without any ulterior motive any ulterior plan and power and how does a air force officer or uh, an indian service officer suddenly take up this path all this is very very cliched and very sort of unrealistic in depiction in this movie kabza it has to have some backing to it performances are not great at all you know nothing really works in this film everything falls flat and the screenplay is so non engaging that i couldn't care for the characters if you don't care for the characters and the build up because it is outdated and because you've seen it before you can't care it will not work so just throwing elements in there of a love story a fight sequence a revenge this that murdering someone killing someone trying to make people feel bad it's not going to happen if you just throw scene after scene after scene you have to build it up from somewhere suddenly someone is dead and some history of someone is dead and someone behead someone then suddenly a love story also exists we are just told facts if i start a movie with within the first 10 minutes and i say okay this is the actor they are already in love with the actress so this is the villain they are very bad by nature this is the people who killed his father and brother therefore they are going to take revenge if i tell you this in the 10 minutes what is the purpose what is the point nobody is going to care if i just brief you like that why would you watch the rest of the movie you have to build it in your screenplay you have to grow the characters the story should go from here to there not just start off like that and go into you know direct mode and beast mode of everyone fighting every time so 
this was my problem with many action movies including pathan where i just thought the action just kept coming there's so much action people are fighting and fighting and fighting and i don't know why they're fighting and how much they're fighting and can there be some brain used here and there to solve some issues what is going on and this is also to remember this is a retro film it's fresh off the independence the growth i'm um, you know you have a more slightly peaceful nature you have a more gandhian impact there these are angles that could have been explored not only in kabza i'm just saying generally but we are constantly running behind gangsters and blood and violence and killing everyone and over the top helicopters this that all this happening we don't need to do this please stop doing this this is not going to work this is not how action films are supposed to be made the setting has to change the back story has to change the characters have to change the music has to change you cannot have similar loud background music and some dialogues here and there to make it a mass movie this is not how it works i have said all this in my teaser and trailer reaction so you can go back and check out my prediction for this movie but this movie absolutely disappointed and is a slight blow to kannada film industry as well as generally the south film industry because after so many super successes last year if we start dishing out such things putting it out on the pan india level and saying this is the next big thing this is going to be amazing this is the next kgf this is the next this that then it's just not going to work and people are going to say oh they made one film and you know the rest doesn't really work so got to be careful I didn't like Kabza at all. I'm going with 2 stars. Leave your thoughts on this movie below. Like, comment, share, subscribe and keep watching for much much more.